Court Walleen, Hi, part Jill. of the Hello. Walleen brother clan, whose yep. family has been bringing Robertas to QVC for as long as I can remember. Almost 20 years. Is that right? Yeah, almost wow, 20 years. almost 20 years. Yeah. Nice Happy to see you. Happy garden planning season. Right? <laughs> Not That's what we're planting, doing. But right, planning. but planning. <laughs> well, we're excited to have this because this completely sold out in March of last year. We just got it back into stock. We're making it available here on our first sort of garden event of the year. M46377 is an American bred, mm -hmm. phenomenal lavender. You're going to get six plants for $34.12. The shipping and handling is free. These are highly fragrant. They are highly tolerant. Mm -hmm. They are beautiful in the garden, a true purple shade. Yes. But what's interesting is that at the end of the season, their foliage actually stays green too. That's right. And fragrant. Green and fragrant yeah. in the garden, folks. I'm telling you, uh, this six piece American bred phenomenal lavender is the first and only American bred lavender in the world. It's brand new, developed and patented in 2012, right here wow. in cold winter Philadelphia area. Yeah, that's special, isn't it? And what this does, it solves the problem that so many lavenders have in America. Mm -hmm. Like your common garden varieties of Hitcoat and Munsetter that you find at all your garden centers. These, like you said, don't die back in the winter. Yeah. They actually stay green and the leaves fragrant. I love that. These do not have root rot and they do not have any foliar fungus that other common uh, varieties. garden varieties uh -huh. will have. They really are phenomenal. Last year, um, when they were really hit the market, we brought them here first last year. Yeah. They were recommended at the Philadelphia Flower Show as a must grow perennial and better homes and gardens as a must buy perennial for the wow. year. So really people are having great years. Uh, success over the last couple of years with these. And if you're ready to uh, rediscover lavender, I highly recommend these for the American gardens. Yeah. Um, Look let's at them show in the ground. You. I mean, they're just beautiful. Look at that color. Yes. It's exquisite. Winter so, hardy yeah. to minus 15 degrees. Nice. All right. Great. And, and then, then, the, then uh, what I was going to say is, what does it add to a garden? Wow. It adds beautiful texture. Mm -hmm. It adds a color of, of lavender that you really don't find in any other plants. No, you know? and no hence a, the name. A, a wispiness to it. <laughs> yes. The fragrance is unmatched, right? Men and women, children all adore lavender. They will uh, draw, uh, attract butterflies to your garden. But yeah. you know what they do? They call it the Swiss Army Knife of herbs because it repels in your garden aphids, mm. caterpillars, ticks, mosquitoes, all those unwanted pests along with uh, deer and rabbits mm. and inside you hang these up and dry them so you're going to grow them then you're going to dry them and then you're going to make crafts with them Jill and when we come back I'll show you how you can make your own sachets, sachets. but indoors folks this will repel the moss silverfish ants and even those awful stink bugs that we get here in Pennsylvania do I need to put these in full sun what are yes. its planting preferences all right these are going to do the best in full hot sun okay and once they're established Mother Nature will take care of them. You never have to drag out the hose. The first year, I always recommend with any plant that mm -hmm. you put in the ground to water it, and then it's established. And Jill, by the third year, the third season, one plant will be about three feet wide okay. and three feet tall, and with maximum care, you'll get up to 1,000 flowers per plant. Wow, by can the we third show year. what we're shipping? Yes, I think let's it's do important. That. You know, you're seeing these big bouquets of lavender, but they all start here. Oh my gosh, that smell. Yes, uh, even, the, even the, just the foliage. That's my favorite thing to do, is to rub my hands on the lavender leaves. Yes. And then just smell. Oh, I love that. It's so nice. It's so it's, nice. You all know about the spa benefits of the of lavender. Yeah, for so sure. So the fragrance. So this so is what you're getting. You're getting six of, six of these. Mm -hmm. If I wanted to do like a walkway, yes. How far apart should I plant them? About three feet. Good apart? question. I would do three feet apart because that's where they spread. So with okay. this six-piece collection, you can do one side of an 18 foot walkway. Nice, and again, it'll grow to that size in about three years. Yes. Keep in mind, you know, it needs some time. Mm -hmm. This is where you're starting. Look. So, you know, but you're, am I gonna get lavender flowers the this first year? year. Yes. Absolutely, yes. yes. You'll Great. get flowers the first year. And I wanna show you that these are well-rooted potted plants. So that means mm -hmm. no fuss, no mess. 
They've also been vernalized, Jill. Vernalized means they've had their first season of cold weather. Yes, that's so important. It I is think. because yes. what it does, it makes them bloom even faster for you when you get them home. I also feel like it almost sort of this is going to be such a dumb way to say it, but it, it kind of builds up their immune system. That's exactly you know what, what I mean? it is. Like they yes. kind of already experienced. It's like the their cold. flu shot. They know what to do. You're they right. know how to handle it. They've yeah. they've they've already had the strength to get through one uh, cold yes. season, mm -hmm. so they're more tolerant the next cold season. And as you said, these are tolerant to minus fifteen. Minus fifteen. These are American bred. When they kind of hit, you know, all the garden shows and everything in the last year or two, the Philadelphia Flower Show talked about how this was a must-have. Perennial yes. Better Homes and Garden said this is a must have perennial for your garden. We completely sold out of this last March and I don't know how many orders of this are coming in this year. I know we have what we have now. It's priced at $34 and 12 cents and these will ship out when court. Are we doing this when it's appropriate yeah. for different areas? Yes, around. Uh -huh. So let's show you our zone map. There's Since your this zone is map. kind of one of our first plants of the year. Yeah, so to tell folks, everybody about. this is garden planning season and you want to plan now and and order these now so you don't miss out. And you find your area of the country, for instance, Indiana is mostly all green, so that'll tell you the week that you'll uh, that'll ship we in ship April. In. Yeah. Yes, yeah, right? so easy peasy. Most of you, you know, in the southern states will get your plants in March. Those of you in the mid states get it in April. Some of you in the extreme north get yours in May. What's mm -hmm. cool about buying plants from QVC, we ship when it's appropriate in your area. Yeah. So that again, that also gives you the best chance for success. That's right. Um, and what about Roberta's guarantee with their plants? Court? All of our plants have a, a, a replacement guarantee on perennials like this one year replacement guarantee. So again, you can see that you can read more about it at QVC.com. Yeah. But you know, that's another thing if you're like, boy, I never thought about buying plants and flowers on TV. You know, we really take the steps to educate you to talk about where it's going to work best, how you would use it and then we back it up as well. We're going to go off to our phones. Patricia's calling in from Michigan. Hi Patricia, I'm Jill here with Court. How are you? I'm doing very well. I'm glad to hear you guys are here and spring is on the way. All right, are yes. you ready to start growing some beautiful flowers, Patricia? Absol absolutely. And what did you think about the lavender? I think it's gorgeous. I love that color. Mm -hmm. That purple is beautiful. Yeah. And I'm the really fragrance? Oh yeah, I mm. love the fragrance mm -hmm. as well. But you say this is uh, going to per perform a little better than all the other ones. That's what I'm looking forward uh, to. Yes, it's, it, it solves all those problems that American gardeners have had with typical garden center varieties. This is bred in America for American conditions. It's sweeping the country. You're going to have beautiful green foliage all winter long. You're going to have no root rot and no foliar uh, diseases whatsoever with this plant like you do with the common garden varieties. I don't think that you can go wrong with this plant. You really uh, can't go wrong. Have you bought <laughs> anything from Roberta's before, Patricia? Oh, many, many things. Oh, good. I, good. Yeah, I've been shopping with Court and his brothers for about nine years now. Oh, uh, well, thank you for growing with us. Oh, I love it. You guys are the greatest, and you do stand behind your product. Yeah, you know, I grew up in the plant business and all, everything that I learned was from my mistakes, mm. you okay. know, but I didn't have a guarantee on all, everything that I made a mistake on, right. but we do, we give you a, a, a replacement guarantee on everything. And I did want to say, stay tuned, Patricia, on Tuesday um, at midnight and yes. then all day. Oh, great. <laughs> I'm looking forward to it. Thanks Thank so much, Patricia. Thank you. You guys have a happy spring. You do the same. You Thank you. Thank you. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. All right, over 2,200 of these have been wow. ordered. They're excited. Yeah. Um, more just back, sold out last March. Mm -hmm. American bread, beautifully fragrant lavender for your garden. I love what you said, American bread and bread for American conditions. That's it. Right? Yeah, so order several sets. You'll have no regrets. It's a phenomenal lavender plant. And I can do these in containers too. You can do them in containers. Great. Uh, M46377. Thank you, Court. I'll Thank see you. you on Tuesday. Awesome. Today's special value from uh -huh. Roberta's on Tuesday. I just had to say it. So make sure you tune in for that. All right, coming up in 10 minutes, we're going to be talking